Okay. Hey guys, how's it going? It's Matt from Fidelity Gaming TV, and welcome back to yet another Mac Money Monday here on MLB 15, the show on the PS4. Your boy Mac Money is doing pretty well. 99 overall, 22 years old. Look at these attributes. These are ridiculous, guys. You see, he's just past the halfway point of his MLB service, which means he's halfway to free agency. But uh, right now, it looks like we might stay with the Braves for a while as they have won. Nine straight and nine of their last ten. Four and a half games above the Nationals for that first place spot in the NL East. And Mac finds himself atop of the All-Star voting for right fielders in the National League with 430 votes or 430,000 votes just above Bryce Harper. So he is looking good and we are going to take a trip out here to Milwaukee as they are struggling a bit. Four games under 500. Like I said, the Braves looking very good. Mac is in the outfield now. Trying to make this play here as this ball is hit pretty fast. It looks like a line drive, and he'll snag that out of the air, and that's a nice play by Mac. Getting eight points for the fielding opportunity, and you see he hasn't shaved in a while, so he is trying to grow that beard out nice and thick. It's getting thick. Now it just needs to grow longer as he's up to bat in the fourth, and that is a single up the left side as he'll get on first with a hit with three points. Uh, I don't know why he didn't get that many points, but you see he is just four hits uh, less than the leader in the National League, Matt Carpenter was 73, Carpenter was 74, and Mac is uh, just trying to play the best he can, get some more votes for the All-Star game. So we're up 4 nothing in the fifth inning, and he's going to get another single here into left as the running shortstop could not come up with it, and he will have himself another hit. So do hit night for Mac Money. He'll get 12 points for the at-bat. Now runners on the corners in the top of the seventh, and... Uh, Pitcher's going to get the best of him there as he will strike out. But he'll go two for four on the night. Nothing special, just two singles, no RBIs or anything. Braves do win this one, though. 4-1 as Ryu improves to 9-1 on the year. And you see we'll sim past the Milwaukee series, which we sweep. We have now won 13 games, no, 12 games in a row. That is ridiculous. So we'll take a trip here to St. Louis. And Mac is looking pretty good here in batting practice. He hits that one deep to center and gone couple pitches later yeah this one's long gone he is looking very good hopefully he can translate this into something good maybe hit one of those in the game as well and get a homer but we'll have to see is the Cardinals are just one game better than the Braves with 40 wins the Braves at 39 Mac is gonna come up to bat here 0 for 1 so far on the day St. Louis up 2 nothing in the top of the fourth no one on with one out we'll see here what Matt can do Here's the first pitch, and he absolutely crushes that one. That is long gone in the left field. That is definitely a Mac Money moonshot. Number 10 on the season. Wow, that was crushed. So, Mac Money has not had the most powerful season of his career, only 10 homers, but that was definitely one that he will remember on this season. A solo shot to left that was a towering no-doubter. Look at that one. Right off the bat, he just knows that's gone. And you'll see here Tyson Ross, who is on the Cardinals. As soon as this one gets hit, he just turns around in disgust. He is not happy with himself as this Cardinals lead is now cut in half 2-1. And now it's 2-2 in the sixth inning. Base is empty. He's leading off the inning. 1-0 pitch is hit into left. And that is another multi-hit game for Mac Money, his second of the day. This one's a single. He'll get 14 points for the at-bat as he is looking pretty good. And the Braves just keep on powering past this Cardinals team. And Mac hits this one deep into right. That's going off the wall. And he is in there with a double. I don't even know what's happening here. Julian Russell decides not to go to third. Wow. So they'll give, they'll give Mac Money the double, but I, I guess he was just waiting for the ball to fall to see if he could get it to go or not. But uh, Mac, on the other hand, gets another hit. Is that his fourth hit of the day? I think that is. That's a four-hit game for Mac Money. Four for five, three runs, a double, a homer, two singles, and an RBI. Braves win six to three. Wow. Just a triple shy of the cycle, and he'll get the player of the game. 
But uh, yeah, the Braves are looking very good now. They have won 13 straight. We're going to take a trip to Boston now as he is crushing it in batting practice, hitting the light pole in left. And now the very next pitch, he just hit that out of the park over the green monster. Very next pitch. Can he go for three home runs in a row in batting practice? That looks deep. And that is way gone. Is Mac Money on steroids? Because the way he's hitting it in batting practice definitely makes it seem like he is. Well, if he is, I hope he doesn't get caught because that would be bad. Anyways, Braves and Red Sox here at Fenway Park. Braves have their 40th win. They did lose the next two of that Cardinals series, by the way. So still stuck at 40 wins, but uh, that isn't stopping Mac Money from making a nice play in right, as he always does. And he'll come here over 3 on the day in the ninth, 2-1 Boston. Last hope for the Braves, and he is going to get that one into left field. That is going to be extra bases. He is rounding first, headed to second, and he will slide in with a double. So 14 points for that at bat, extra base hit, and hopefully the Braves can capitalize on that, but they cannot. So he is stranded on second. They can't tie up the game. Red Sox win 2-1. As Norman gets the win, Mac only went one for four with that double. That's all right. You know what? I guess that one double could have helped him, but uh, it didn't. So can't get too mad at that. And have you noticed that these fans in the crowd don't even have like legit jerseys? They literally just say player with the number zero on the back. I just noticed that in Miami. I don't know if any of you guys noticed that, but then I've been looking closer and it's literally like that in every single ballpark. So that's really weird. Anyways, aside from that, Mac is getting a base hit right up the middle here. Nothing new. He is looking very, very good. Like I said, possibly on steroids, but I don't think he would do that. Now we'll go to the top of the fourth. No outs. Runner on first, and this is a chopper in front. Catcher picks it up, and Mac is going to beat it out. Wow. So he'll get four points for the at-bat for the bad base hit, but um, look at this. He's not even that fast of a guy, but he beat this out. That was a bad throw by the catcher, and now he has two hits. 2-0 Braves, top of the fifth, runner in scoring position, and that is going to fall in front of Marcelo Zuna. And there was two outs, so the runner was going, and he will easily score. So Mac has an RBI single there. He'll get 20 points for the at-bat, and that is his third hit of the day. Can he get another four-hit game in the seventh? Yes, he can with a single into left. Mac Money is on fire right now. Got a home run, got a bunch of singles and doubles, 12 points for the at-bat. Can he go 5-for-5 five five and get his first career 5-hit game here in the ninth? We're up 5-1, base is empty, one out. First pitch of the at-bat, can he get 5 hits? Well, he hits this one deep to left. This might have a chance, Christian Yelich is under it, and he will make the catch. So unfortunately, we cannot get 5 hits. That would have been awesome if it was a homer, but it isn't. No hit, and he will go 4-for-5 four on the day with a run. All four of those hits were singles, by the way, and one RBI. Braves win this one 5-2 as we get a nice view of the grass here in Miami, and we will travel to the other side of the country, also in a nice sunny city. San Diego here as Mac Money is taking on the Padres with the Braves, and he has got himself a five-game hitting streak. He's 12-21 for 21 in that. We'll see if he can make it six here as the 1-0 pitch is coming to him, and he is hitting this one in the left field gap. That is going back. That's going to carry. And that is gone. That's a home run. I did not expect that to land. I, I Actually, I did expect that to land in, in play. But instead, it carries all the way in left center and goes over the wall. Unbelievable. So it's 3-3 here in the top of the fifth. And Mac is just adding on to what is an incredible episode. He gets a single there into right. And 12 points for the at-bat, but I, I still can't get over that home run. I thought that was going to drop. Base is loaded now in the sixth. He's hitting this one deep to center. And unfortunately, it's going to be caught by the center fielder. Runner will tag from second to third and third to home. So we will get a sack fly there at the RBI. 17 points for the at-bat, but no base hit. That's all right. He already got that homer, which I still can't get over. Braves win again. 7-4. Dylan Key with the win. He's 7-4 now as Mack went 2-4 for four on the night. With a run, a homer, a single, and two RBI, I believe. So we're simming through here. And guess what? For the third consecutive year, he is voted 
in to the All-Star game. Mac Money is your 2018 right field starter for the National League. He finished with 605,000 votes, which was seven, or sorry, five plus eight. I can't even do math right now. 13 more, 13,000 more votes than Bryce Harper. So the Braves looking very good. Mac Money once again in the All-Star game, second year in a row for the National League the year before was the American League with the White Sox, but I hope you guys enjoyed. This was an awesome episode. Come back next time. We'll be in the All-Star game, wherever that's at, in 2018. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to like the video for more. Make sure to subscribe, and peace!